Whoops. Yep. Okay. What? So we uh, have had a few stressful days. So we're gonna go blow off some steam and talk off. Caleb's coming with us. We gotta get a. Uh, we gotta go get him a monster though. So you know, you know it is what it is. Priorities. Priorities. Not gonna lie, been stressed. Decided to uh, to get to play. So for all the ones that Nate videotapes, he videotapes the one that he wins. Look at this. 120 freaking points. Right there. 124 points. Right on time. So today, it's got a busy day. We are actually headed to look at, get a game plan together for the flip we just bought. Um, we also have a listing agreement coming up. Uh, so we're gonna go meet the sellers then we're gonna come back and we're gonna catch up from the weekend. So busy day, let's get it started. All right, we're here. Gonna go inside, let's get a game plan together. I don't know, man. I hope I have the right key to this place. Let's try another set. Yeah, thank you. 2,000 years later. I think they just looked at all of them. You know what I mean? Like, they just turned down and... Oh, snap! Whoops. Uh, yep. Okay. What? Do we need to get some blue tape and tape the places that need some work? Yeah. That's no. what we'll do. We got some. We can do that. You know, just because I, what I want to know is what is it going to cost to do the floors? You know what I'm saying? No shoe hole back. If you if you think like it's gonna be if, if it's called if we can keep this now we I want to change the knobs. Yeah. yeah. We definitely want to change all the lighting in here. Right. Um, we're gonna put new stove. Right. New dishwasher. You don't have a microwave, does it? Um, I, these are actually pretty nice, so we may need those. Yeah. yeah. We want to make sure it's we want to make sure it's done right, but let's you know. So laminate throughout. I'm thinking quoting just to make sure. But yeah, I mean, you, you tell me what, what it's gonna cost us. Cause we got a lot of walls, so we're gonna have a little ways, but it is what it is. <laughs> That's the only way to make it look consistent to the house, I think. Me too. And that's exactly what I would do. Because- um, It just hurts my heart. Yeah. Hurts my heart covering that stuff. Cause you like hardwood? Huh? Cause you like hardwood. I love hardwood. Yeah. Uh, that tree that was just so big. Yeah. Now we, we could we, cut it. Down. We could probably trim these up. Uh -huh. um, and like I, I don't know, let's let's look here, but I, I want all this cleaned up. You want the paint the cabinet? I'd like to, if I can, if, if, if we can paint the if we can paint the cabinets, re, re, put all new appliances in, and redo the countertops. Yeah. That's what I'd prefer. All right, so we just got a game plan together with Jason. Uh, I think I'll have to cut.
cover these hardwoods and that hurts my heart because I love hardwoods but we're probably gonna go ahead and replace that put um, a really nice laminate throughout there's just too many places too many damages in the floor we're gonna have to rip up the floor in one of the rooms and uh, I just think it's gonna be better but anyway got a game plan together know what we're gonna do with the kitchen know what we're gonna do with the floors and all of that and uh, now we have to go turn on all the lights and turn on the water all right so we're finishing up the day uh, we've had a lot of little catching up and we're really going through the flip kind of setting the number setting the budget um, got all the lights turned on water turned on everything to get it done so here's the way you need to think about it when you're doing a flip you want uh, you want to think about, hey, here's the best case scenario, but you got to plan on the worst case scenario. So, for us, we bought the house at 115,000. Okay. Now, then we also had 5,000 in fees, closing fees. It's actually a little high, but long story short, I wanted to do it a certain way to make it a lot easier. So, purchase price was 115, 5,000. Um, so right now we're bought in at 120k. All right. Now, what I'm trying to do is, I'm, I, my best case scenario, I'd like to get this done in two weeks, um, if at all possible. But you got to think about it. What's worst case scenario? I'm gonna budget three weeks, so it costs me about three grand a week in labor. Three weeks. That's nine thousand. Let's go ahead and bump it to ten thousand dollars. So we're gonna have ten thousand in labor. Right. Uh, supplies is gonna be so my guess is it's gonna be about 15,000 give or take but we're gonna go ahead and bump that up to twenty thousand dollars because you need to know at worst case scenario are you still gonna make money so we're gonna say twenty thousand just to be safe so that it gives us at thirty thousand dollars in renovations um, so after that, we'll have about 150 K bought in to the property. Um, my hope is to sell it around the 199.9 range, maybe a little more, depending on where the market is, when we get ready to sell it. But the good thing about this is that gives us room because you still got to pay taxes. You got to pay fees. You got to pay another realtor to, if they bring a buyer, a lot of things that go into selling this property okay but you've got to think about it of what's the worst case we got enough playroom that if i'm off 10 or fifteen thousand dollars we're still going to be able to walk away make a good chunk and everybody's happy so that's what we're working on we're getting the p l's together and we're gonna make it happen so we're gonna let you follow along and uh i'm excited about it i'm excited about starting it and this leading to being able to buy rental properties and just creating the ecosystem um, where people can come and prosper and everybody wins. So that's what we're working on the rest of the day. I'm excited. Thank you for watching. Love you guys. Until next time, go make some magic happen.